Hi friends, how are you today? As you know, I love books, I love good stories, and I love sharing them with you. And I've got a perfect story for fall. It's called The Golden Acorn. And it is written and illustrated by Katie Hudson. And I've read several of her other stories before. They are so good, so be sure to check those out too. But this one is perfect for fall, so I hope you like it as much as I do. Let's get started. And she always has great opening pages. Look at all this. Tells us so much before we even start the story. Golden Acorn Hunt Strategy. Look at all that. Squirrels Running Training Plan. Hmm, first place, only gold will do. The golden acorn hunt, the fastest race in town returns. Hmm. Squirrel loved being the fastest. She could fly through the trees faster than anybody and had the trophy collection to prove it. Wow. Her most prized trophies were from the annual golden acorn hunt. Only the fastest racers won the golden acorn and squirrel had taken it home for the last eight years. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It says new acorn spot. That's where she wants to put a new trophy. But this year was different. Hmm. Oh, look at this poster, the Golden Acorn Hunt. All those competing in tomorrow's Golden Acorn Hunt must do so as part of a team, Beaver read. Squirrel scoffed, but I'm the fastest animal in the forest. I don't need a team. But we'd love to be on your team, Squirrel, Rabbit said brightly. <laughs> you? Squirrel looked at her friends. They really did not seem like race material. Hmm. But Squirrel had no choice. The race was tomorrow. Maybe a little training would do the trick. Uh-oh, or maybe not. Oh, Squirrel's treetop boot camp. Oh, poor little rabbit. Oh, look at tortoise. Oh, look at bear. Oh boy, yikes. The 60 and 60th annual Golden Acorn Hunt. Here's the starting line. There's the judge. The next morning, Squirrel gathered her friend, her team at the starting line. The Golden Acorn has been hidden, the judge yelled. Ready, set, go! Whoosh! Squirrel was off, overtaking all the other racers, even her own team. Squirrel, wait, her friends called. We've lost Tortoise. Ugh, ugh. Tortoise, huffed Squirrel, turning back. Oh, look at Tortoise. Squirrel grabbed Tortoise, plopped him back on the branch, and took off again. But not for long. Squirrel, wait. Her friends called once more. We're all tangled up. <laughs> Oops. You can't be serious, Squirrel moaned. Ugh. Squirrel untangled her friends and was off yet again for about 10 seconds. Squirrel, wait, her friends called. Beaver's stuck. Oh, can you see that? He's stuck in the tree. Oh, come on, Squirrel groaned. <laughs> Poor Beaver. <laughs> Once Beaver's bottom <laughs> was pushed free, Squirrel was off as fast as her feet would carry her, so fast that she didn't even hear her friends calling for her. <sighs> oh, look at little rabbit, barely hanging on the branch there. Oh. Over logs and under branches, inside trunks and above treetops, Squirrel raced as fast as she could to find the golden acorn until oh, there it was. Do you see it? She found it. 
It was the biggest golden acorn squirrel had ever seen. She pried it from its hiding spot and took off. Hmm. Oh, but the golden acorn was heavy, much too heavy to carry alone. And there was only Squirrel. Look at our Squirrel. <laughs> All by herself, Squirrel and her golden prize. Oh, after lots and lots of rolling and pushing and heaving, oh, she had a little rest. She was tired and sweaty. Oh. And lonely. Oh, that squirrel all by herself. And a squirrel looked out at all the other racers still searching for the acorn. She realized she had lost her friends. The golden acorn would just have to wait. Whoosh! Off squirrel raced faster than she ever had before. Over logs, under branches, inside trunks, and above the treetops. Until... There they were! Oh, they're having some trouble. After lots and lots of rolling and pushing and heaving, Squirrel oh, had her friends back. Her team didn't come in first, and they didn't get a trophy, but it didn't matter. There's the finish line. There's the golden acorn. Look who got it. From now on, Squirrel's friends would always come first. Aww. It really is all about teamwork, isn't it? I just love that story. That's The Golden Acorn, the perfect book for fall. I hope you liked it as much as I do. I hope you're having a great day, friends. Take care. I'll see you soon. Bye now.